it's about 3,000 pounds. The University of Texas Pan American is training the next generation of transportation engineers with its first ever University Transportation Center for Railway Safety Summer Camp. About 600 elementary and middle school students from across the Rio Grande Valley are getting the inside track on what it takes to be an engineer through projects and other activities on campus. The students have been working in teams, creating vehicles using Lego robots and learning about railway safety by developing magnetic levitation trains. Well, it's kind of like going to school, like, but just for like four days and you learn a lot here and it's, I thought it was really fun. Dr. Constantine Tarone, an associate professor of mechanical engineering at UTPA and director of the Railway Safety Center, says the camp targets younger students because they are more open to learning more math and science. I, I, use, I like to call it the MacGyver gene, Get this like problem solving, oh I, I got into a problem, how do I solve it, how do I resolve it, working with teams, try to get into the idea of working as effectively with, together, just get them, uh, if anything, uh, get them familiar with the different fields, so that in middle school they can be more focused and by the time they go high school, now they're ready and now they're starting their college careers a little bit earlier, they can do dual enrollment, they can do a lot of the things that will get them to the college faster and out of the door with a degree even faster. UTPA's College of Engineering and Computer Science teamed up with the College of Education to make complex engineering problems understandable to the youngsters. Dr. Carmen Benya, an associate professor of curriculum and instruction at UTPA, says she and her colleagues found the perfect lesson plans in working with the robots and magnetic trains. These kids are just amazing in terms of the level of difficulty they can handle. They've already learned to program using loops, uh, using switches, uh, using if-then logic, uh, so they're programming and they're building at the same time. And I, I look at them grow, I see them, you know, come in and a little bit shaky, you know, you're asking us to program and build robots, and they look very hesitant, but, you know, two or three days in, it's great to see the confidence in them when they say, oh, I can program a robot, I, and I proved to myself that I could build the bumper car to do the things that it needs to do. The camp, which is funded by a grant from the U.S. Department of Transportation, is open to all students who are eager to learn more about math and science. I'm Jennifer Berg. I'm reporting for UTPA.